hyperthyroidism. Hyperthyroidism is caused by an excess of the circulating thyroid hormones. An excess or too much of the thyroid hormone would cause the body to have a hypermetabolism or a very fast metabolism. Not only that, it also increases the sympathetic nervous system. Now keep in mind that the thyroid hormones directly stimulate the heart. So this results in an increased heart rate, right, and a stroke volume that that causes an increase in cardiac output and blood flow. One of the main causes of hyperthyroidism is Graves' disease. Now what is Graves' disease? Graves' disease is an autoimmune system in which your own body makes antibodies, right? And these antibodies attaches themselves to the TSH receptors or the thyroid stimulating hormone receptors within the thyroid tissue. And when that occurs, the thyroid gland end up increasing and therefore overproducing thyroid hormones. Now, since a hyperthyroid patient has hypermetabolism or a very fast metabolism, we then need to take note of the patient's weight. These patients will usually report a sudden weight loss or an increase in appetite. Also, patients with hyperthyroidism seem to have heat intolerance. What that basically means is that their body has a hard time tolerating heat. So, usually these patients would be sweating or having diaphoresis even when the temperature is fairly normal and sometimes on the winter time they usually would wear lighter clothing than other people. In regards to the cardiovascular system these patients would have tachycardia and is prone to having palpitations. So what as nurses can we do for the patient? Well we can encourage the patient to get some rest and make sure that the environment is quiet as possible. Also we can give the patient antithyroid drugs. Obviously the antithyroid drugs block thyroid hormone production right? Or decreases the thyroid hormone production. Now one of the most common drugs used are methamazole which is tapazole and propothyoracil which is PTU. Also take note that one of the most effective treatment for hyperthyroidism is the radioactive iodine treatment. The reason why this treatment is very effective is the fact that the thyroid cells are the only cells in the body which has the ability to actually absorb iodine. Now what we do is we give the patient a radioactive form of iodine in which the thyroid cells which absorb this iodine will be damaged or get killed. In contrast, the most common side effect of this treatment is the underactivity of the thyroid gland which is what we call hypothyroidism, right? Because we basically killed too much of the thyroid cells.